Okay, now we will turn to the assumption of homoscedasticity, which means that you have equal variance along the whole range of the, uh, the model. So what we'll do now is calculate the studentized residuals uh, as R student for model 7. This is basically come out no matter what kind of residuals you use, but we'll use the studentized, which um, is deleting one observation and kind of standardizing the uh, residuals. And then we'll uh, get the fitted values, which is the same thing, by the way, that we had earlier in one of my videos where we uh, had the uh, predicted values, just predict in model uh, seven. Um, but they come automatically in the uh, R output, so we'll just use the fitted values. And then we're gonna plot those. So the fitted values will just be uh, all the values that we might have for uh, our model. And we will look at the residuals as we go along there, make sure that they don't change, that the residuals are about the same no matter where you are in the, uh, in the model. And so we'll run that. And we just look for an, an even spread around here. We don't want to see that funnel pattern, and we don't want to see any kind of curve kind of things. And I, th I think that looks fairly reasonable there. Uh, a second A second test that we can use is the NCV test, which just is a non-constant variance test, and that's in the uh, car package. And basically, uh, we're saying that the chi-square has a high p-value. HO is that you have equal variance, and we can't reject that with this test, so we say that it's reasonable to say that we have equal variance along the, uh, the constant variance along the uh, range of the model. And then the uh, spread level plot. Um, basically, if you see anything that looks like a linear relationship here, uh, then that would indicate that the variance uh, changes along the model. So we're pretty flat here, and so uh, we will leave it at that. Uh, you might look on my other videos where I do a little bit more explanation of, for example, what is a spread level plot and so on. Um, but So here, this is just how to get it and how to interpret it.